how's it going everybody Clash here and welcome back for some more Kingdom Hearts and last time we left off here in Traverse Town in Sid's shop and we had just teamed up with Donald and Goofy and they sort of decided together that they were going to embark on some epic quest to find King Mickey and find Riku and Kairi who we don't really ever see again because they're assholes and blah blah we kicked the shit out of that one tin can heartless guy the one boss fight that we had it was our first boss fight well, actually, not our first boss fight in the game, but our first boss fight with uh, Donald and Goofy. First boss fight was at, like the very first fight of the game. Like we killed the one Shadow Sora or whatever the hell he was called. But point is, is that now we can uh, keep on going. I'm pretty sure I already tried buying some stuff from Sid, and he didn't really have too much on him. At least nothing that I would really want to add to our inventory. I bought like one ring or some shit, but. I'm now playing this game after taking a sort of week and a half long break. I'm pretty sure Ooh, we can do this Trinity. Sweet. Yeah, I did a. Uh, I did that first batch. Holy crap! Got a good amount of experience out of that. Sweet. So yeah, I did the first recording and sort of saved that footage for later this weekend, when uh, which is when I'll probably finally premiere this series and. The reason for that is I wanted to have the footage beforehand because I'm trying to stockpile a bunch. And I believe... Hold on. Can we get this yet? I don't think we can. Can we? Yeah, that's, I'm pretty sure that's a Trinity thing. And that might be the place of... Oh, here's the item shop. Pretty sure Donald's nephews run this. Here we go. Alright, let's go ahead and see if we can buy anything worthwhile here. I'm here to shop. So... Yeah, I uh, recorded a bunch of that like a week and a half ago, a bunch of this, and then I played The Last of Us for about four or five days straight. Like, I recorded it for several hours every single day, mostly because I just couldn't put the game down. And hold on, I can't hold anymore? Are you kidding me? Yes, I can. Don't lie to me. Oh, crap, I'm already, like, out of money here. Could have gotten more stuff for Donald and Goofy, too, but... Oh well, that's a shame. So I'm imagining I can't really buy stuff from you guys either. Yeah, they're just gonna talk to us about random crap. I'm in charge of keeping the shop clean. Am I better? Am I tougher? Why? You'd think that a single bedroom would be easier to keep clean than, an, than the entire shop, but... Whatever. Anyways, yeah. I uh, couldn't put the game down. And... So I did all of The Last of Us. Just finished that. Uh, yesterday. So now on to recording a buttload of Kingdom Hearts, which hopefully you guys will enjoy. Because at the time of recording this, I still haven't even premiered the first episode, but... Uh, what are we doing here? Observe the battle level when selecting destinations. More stars mean stronger Heartless in that world. And cool. Awesome. So we can go to this one star world, or we can go to the two star world. Why can't I... There you go. I was trying to like go to the right. Apparently the right doesn't work. Yeah, it does. That was weird. Oh, it's like the bottom right that doesn't work. Like, I'm trying to... You probably hear the controller going and it doesn't work. Anyways, let's go to the two-star world. Fuck it. I don't care. I'll take on the two-star world. But anyways, yeah. Um... Uh-oh, Donald has some stuff for us. We travel to different worlds on the gummy ship. And, hey, what's up, Goofy? The heartless ships often give us a hard time. Is that so? Always be on the lookout during flight. Control the gummy ship with the left analog stick. Tilt it up to descend and tilt it down to ascend. And you reverse controls. I don't know how I feel about that. The blue gauge shows the power level. Firing lasers, among other things, consumes power. The green gauge shows the strength of the armor. If we reach a zero, it's back to the departing point. All right, cool. Well, hopefully this goes well. Never really been a huge fan of the whole gummy ship segment, but it's not bad. I just. I've never really thought it fit too well with the core gameplay that is Kingdom Hearts, but I think they may have changed it a bit in the second game. I don't really remember. It's been a while since I played either one, but we'll see. So yeah, I just thought I'd mention that. I don't know. Great game. The Last of Us, that is. Uh, if you have access to it, like I said during that playthrough, I would highly recommend you go and get it because it's a pretty stellar game. I myself will probably play through it again several times. Maybe one of those times will even be on the channel again. 
Uh, like I mentioned, I might do it on the Survivor Plus difficulty. Seems like a lot of people enjoyed that game. And it's been a really long time since I've had that much fun uh, playing a game uh, that, that, like, just came out. And it's been a really long time since I've had that much fun recording something, too. Like, as you can imagine, I sat down for, like, two or three, sometimes four hours each day to record it. And I finished it in maybe four or five sit-downs. And it took, like, maybe six or seven... I think it was actually a, a total of eight recordings. No, it was seven recordings. It was definitely seven, like, recording files, and I was done. And... I just can't say enough good things about that game. But anyways, this is Kingdom Hearts. Try to talk about this for a while. Speaking of Kingdom Hearts, um... Throughout this series, and probably Kingdom Hearts 2 as well, you'll probably hear me talk a lot about uh, what I would want out of Kingdom Hearts 3, now that it's finally been announced, and just gen in general chat about Kingdom Hearts whenever there's an opportunity to. And these gummy ship missions are a pretty good opportunity to do that, so... Yeah, I just thought I'd mention that. I personally uh, am more excited for Kingdom Hearts 3 than really anything else that's been announced at E3 this year, so... Hopefully you are too if you're watching this, and I hope you enjoy watching me play through the trilogy. And now we can disembark, sweet. Olympus Coliseum? Why are we already over here? I thought this was gonna be like Tarzan's jungle or some shit. Alright. Fine, be that way. Olympus Coliseum, yeah! I can't wait to see what shenanigans we get into over here. All right, nobody's gonna say anything. <laughs> I would have expected sort of be like, "Whoa, <laughs> giant statues," something like that. I don't know, but I've actually always been disappointed with the Colosseum. I've always wanted to like play through the actual Hercules world, even though there is like a story to the Hercules world, and I believe in Kingdom Hearts too. You actually, you actually go into the underworld or whatever, but. Oh, there's a trinity right here. Sweet. Yeah, I've always liked the, the Hercules sort of movie and franchise or whatever. So, I would prefer... Ooh, the Dalmatians. Cool. I would prefer to just play through the world or whatever. So, anyways, random thoughts on Kingdom Hearts by Clash. Brought to you by YouTube.com backslash this site sucks asshole. Into the lobby we go. And, oh, what's up, Phil? <gasps> There's a little save point thing here. Let's do it. Sure. I don't mind. I'll save to my heart's content. There we go. And I'm pretty sure I have a backup, don't I? Oh, God. Maybe I don't. Yeah, let's make a backup save, just in case shit goes down. And it's shit that I don't like. The bad, sort of smelly, poopy, terrible shit. Hold on. Is that from this playthrough? I don't even know. Whatever. I just need to remember to make multiple saves at the start of each recording in case the recording fucks up and I need to re-record stuff. Alright, sorry about that, but Cloud was being an asshole and making a lot of noise, so I had to make him stop so I could keep recording and uh, not have annoying background noise. Normally, he doesn't make too much noise, but he was banging his stupid antler bone thing on the... Uh, on the floor of his crate, so... Anyways, let's go ahead and talk to Phil. Um... Good timing. Give me a hand, will ya? Move that pedestal over there for me? I gotta spruce this place up for the games! The games! <laughs> I love Phil. He's pretty cool. I like him as a character. Uh, so how do I push this? Oh, just like that? It weighs a ton. Yeah, we're not gonna be able to push this. Phil, Mr. Goat. It's way too heavy. What? Too heavy? Since when have you been such a little? Oh, wrong guy. What are you doing here? Packing on the pounds, I see there, Phil. This here is the world famous Coliseum, heroes only. And I got my hands full preparing for the games. So run along, pipsqueaks. The games! <laughs> Look, it's like this. Heroes are coming from all over.
to fight ferocious monsters right here in the Coliseum. You got a one standing right in front of you. Yup, he's a real hero chosen by the Keyblade. And we're heroes too. Damn straight. Hero? That front? <laughs> What's so funny? I fought a bunch of monsters. Don't dislocate your unibrow, Phil. Hey, if you can't even move this. You can't move it either. You can't cause yourself. <laughs> the hero! Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Yeah. Don't have a heart attack, Phil. And give birth at the same time. Okay, so it takes more than brawn. Well, well, let's see what you can do. What can I do? I'm only three weeks old. Might as well be in the womb still. This trial is tough. You got what it takes? You ready? I'm ready. Okay, kid, let's see what you've got. What do I got? I guess we, we will see. What the hell are we doing? I don't even remember... I don't remember anything about this game, really. The rules are simple. Bust all the barrels within the time limit. Okay. Sounds easy enough. <gasps> epic music. I love epic music. It's so epic. Oh, Jesus. All right, how do we do this? Just like so. Oh, hell yeah. That worked out. Damn straight. And now, I think we only have these two. Goodbye. And 10 seconds. We have one more to go. Oh, easy. Not bad. For a beginner, that is. Hey. First try, come on now. Give me some points there, Phil. And, oh god. <laughs> I don't think I can get this on the first try. Bust all the barrels, yeah. Same basic thing. This is gonna suck. Like, really bad. And, oh, hey, I can probably knock this one into that one. There we go. Just wheel around here. And, oh my god, I thought that thing was gonna block me for a second. I would have been pissed, let me tell you. Okay, come on. Aw, oh, shit. That probably screwed me over right there. Need to be more effective here. Oh, yeah, this is terrible. No! Sora! You're screwing me over, man. Oh, uh, no. Come on. Shit. 20 seconds. There's no way. There's no way. There we go. Oh, that worked out. Holy shit, I got the one on that platform! That was amazing! <laughs> Go me. I'm impressed with myself right now. You know, you ain't bad, kid. <laughs> Looks like I'm headed for the games. Afraid not. Why not? Two words. You guys ain't heroes. Come on! <laughs> oh, is that like four? Four or five words? I think it was four. You guys ain't heroes, yeah. Uh, Want to become a real hero? Sorry, I'm mastering this spell. Ugh. Attain the power of thunder. Sweet. Didn't see that coming. Well, since they won't let us, they're not gonna let us do our thing here. They're not gonna let us join the games. I guess we're out of here. Oh, hold on, was that a blue trinity over there? Hmm, uh, rather a stubborn old goat. Wouldn't you say? Who are you? <laughs> oh, hey, hold on there, Fuzzboy. Oh, there. Wait, let me guess. You want to enter the games, right? Well, then, hey, get a load of this. What a pervert. Ooh. A pass? It's all yours. Good luck, kid. I'm pulling for you, little shorty. I think Hades is a pedophile. Touching Sora. Sora is only three years old, man. You gotta leave the kid alone. Um, where are we going? Yeah, I saw a blue trinity over here. I did not notice this before. Oh, well. Better late than never. Whoa! Ooh, item. Oh, I think there's another one on the other side, but I was just too dumb to notice it. I don't really remember. Yeah, wasn't there another one right here? I have no idea. Whatever. Doesn't matter now. Good guy. Yeah, let's get the hell out of here. I don't even think I'm ready for the games anyways, so... Screw it. It is irrelevant. So, I don't know if we can... Fast travel. 
I don't know. See, if I can't do the Coliseum, because I doubt I can take on, like, I think you have to fight Cerberus, and I remember that being a semi-difficult boss fight. That's a three-star world. I don't understand. I could have sworn the Coliseum was over here, and the jungle was over here. Maybe it's random. Oh, no. Normal drive. Cloud. Hey, stop dreaming. Cloud. Weirdo. Apparently Cloud was having a nightmare or something, and he was... He was barking at something in this dream. Stupid dog. Don't you know that you're dreaming? I don't know what I'm dreaming. I always wanted to, like, develop the ability, though, because apparently it's possible. And I know this is a really random thing to talk about, but... Because Cloud brought it up, apparently. Um... If you, like, take notes on your dreams or something, like, every single time you have a dream, you record what you... what happened in your dream, like, the second you wake up in, like, a journal or, you know, something along those lines. If you do that, um, apparently... Oh, God. No, I missed the second one. Shit. Not that it matters. I don't really care about gummy ship stuff, but... Yeah, if you record that stuff, eventually, you will be able to tell when you're dreaming in the middle of the dream and then you can make anything happen once you do that. I've always wanted to try that out. Start learning how to control my dreams because then you could have some awesome fucking dreams. Like I could do whatever I wanted. Pretend I'm a character from Dragon Ball Z and I can fly and shit. That's really all I want to do. I want to fly. But I don't know. It sounds like a lot of work. And apparently it takes a while to, to do. Of course, Cloud will never get there. He'll never be able to dream that he's in doggy heaven or whatever, eating food and being petted all day and going on every run that he could possibly want to go on. Now he's just looking at me like really confused, like, where the hell am I? <laughs> How'd I get here? Why am I here? And we're back in Traverse Town. Fantastic. What the hell? Why are there just more... Alright then. More random ships. Yeah, I want to select world. So we can't fast travel between worlds yet. That kind of really sucks. I think we get like the hyperdrive or whatever that allows us to go to world we've already been to without doing this thing again. At some point. So that sucks. I have to say. I probably should have just gone to Tarzan's world. So I would assume that's Tarzan the world over there. Yeah, I'm still confused. I could have sworn that Olympus Coliseum was the three-star world, and Tarzan's world was the uh, two-star one, but I wish I could do about it now. Oh, God. So, yeah. Speaking of uh, King Mart 3, because I know I said I would talk about that, um, there was a rumor, I'm pretty sure, now that Star Wars is owned by Disney that it's possible Star Wars could end up... Ow, shit. It could end up being in the next Kingdom Hearts, which I personally wouldn't really care to see. I mean, I like Star Wars as much as the next guy. I'm not really fanatical about it like some people are, but, you know, it's Star Wars. It's cool. 